Hi, it's Cameron Shackle from Active Adapter. In this session, I'm just going to have a quick chat about uh, debatching the results that come in from our receive Active Directory receive adapter. Um, when you configure a BizTalk receive location using Active Adapter, the results come in in a single message such as this and so if you've got three active directory objects a b and c and you query your query returns all of them you'll get a single message with a b and c in them and we've had a few questions over the last several years about how to get those results in as single messages for whatever purpose you might have in in biztalk and the way to do that is uh, simply to use the default XML receive pipeline on your receive location. Um, if you take a look at the receive XML receive pipeline, there are a couple of settings there for envelope spec and document spec. So you just need to create those and deploy them to your BizTalk application and put the names in there and then your message will be debatched as it um, enters the pipeline. Um, I've done a couple of those here in Visual Studio. Here's my envelope schema which has the top level element Active Directory query results, filter match which is our repeating element and under that I've just put in any element and Here's our filter match payload, which is the element that repeats. And I've created that and put in any attribute and any element under there, which just covers all the content. Um, there are a couple other things you need to do in Visual Studio. For example, you need to um, specify on the envelope schema that it is in fact an envelope, as I've done there. And you need to um, specify the X path for the messages which I've done there and there's a, a nice little chooser tool there in this case it's the top level element so I created a couple of those and I've deployed them uh, into BizTalk uh, there are the schemas there the only thing left to do with that is to grab our um, assembly names and put those into the pipeline. I've already copied one into Notepad to be used, which is the filter match uh, schema, uh, the filter match envelope as the name there. I'll just copy that. and the assembly name will be the same so if I take our filter match that's our document spec I copy that into our pipeline under document spec it's quite a long string grab our other value which is our envelope spec and there we have our XML receive configured and as you can see that receive location is configured with Active Directory and it's just doing a query every 20 seconds on our OU with our A, B, and C objects in there. Click OK there. Let's start our. First of all, I'll clear out the, uh, the folder where we're receiving our results. Now I'll start to generate a query, and we should see three messages pop up there. There we go. Let's stop that 
and each of those messages contains a single entry. So that's what it looked like before we added the debatching in the pipeline, each of those containing our results. So we had three results. Now we've got one result for A, one result for B, and one message for C. So that's been automatically debatched and is ready for any logic you have inside your BizTalk application. Uh, that was just a quick discussion of debatching Active Directory um, query results uh, in the XML receive default pipeline. Thanks for watching and happy biz talking.